So I hit record and then live on Facebook. Let's take just a second. <sighs> do to do to do. All right, what this is a total different screen than I'm used to. Okay. They changed something. No, it's live. Okay. Hey, you guys, we're starting in just a second here. We're getting all set up. I have a special guest, Zara. And I'm really excited to get started here. All right, Zara. So um, it's still spinning. Is it live? On Facebook? Okay. Hey, you guys. Um, welcome, welcome, welcome. This is Free Healing Tuesday. And Zara is a master practitioner and teacher of sacred activations. And last Wednesday on a call we were on, she did shaman um, singing and playing, and it was absolutely incredible. So I invited her on to share with all of us today because I think the healing she does with this is amazing and I think you're all going to benefit from this very very nicely so um, Zara if you could go ahead and share with people what their intentions should be and all that good stuff turn it over to you okay yeah. welcome everyone okay speak uh, up a little bit honey I'm trying <laughs> there you go can, can, can you hear me yes okay so welcome everyone. It's not uh, exactly healing, it's creation, what I do, creation through sound, um, which means that um, everything you want to create in your reality already exists somewhere. So what, what you do is just uh, bring through the sounds uh, that created here in this reality. So I would uh, like you to just focus on whatever it is that you want to create in your life. And it should come from the heart. And just uh, take a few moments to feel, to, f to feel the feeling of that in your body as if it is already here, All right? Just, just breathe for a few minutes. And just feel whatever you want to create as if it's already there in your body. And what does that feel like? And just ask yourself if you have that feeling can I have this now? And if anything comes up, um, like it's impossible or I don't believe it or um, whatever reasons there may be that your subconscious says you're, you're not going to have it, right? Um, then I will sing for that to release. And for those ones who um, have nothing coming up where it's totally, the road is totally clear to your desired manifestation, I am going to sing for that to manifest in your life with the best possible timing. <laughs> and for the highest good of all concerned. Okay. 
I'm going to, to tune in to everyone who is here on the call and everyone uh, who is going to watch the replay later. And just think for this intention. And there might also be some light language coming through in between or at the end of it, just so you know. Okay. Hi, Emma. Hi, Emma. I'm 
What, sweetie? I just had to get rid of some stuff. Um, okay. Okay. Okay, you're gonna keep going, right? Yeah. Okay. Speak up a little bit, honey, when you're doing that. Oh, was that the ending prayer? Yes. Okay. That was absolutely beautiful. Woohoo! Absolutely you. love it. Thank you so much. Thank you for giving me the opportunity to be here. You're so welcome. You're so funny. When you're speaking, you're so quiet, but when you're singing, it's just so beautiful and out out there. Speak in your singing voice. <laughs> I need I, to be connected to do that. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, absolutely beautiful. Um, Kim says, thank you. Awesome. Okay. Um, do you want to talk to anybody? Should I have people raise their hands? Uh, I don't know how this works. That's, so that's up to you. Oh, three panelists raise their hands. So let's see here. We've got Anita. Let me allow her to talk. Bring you on, Anita. I'm gonna unmute you. Okay, let me unmute you. Are you clicking the mute button? I'll let you unmute yourself. There we go. Okay, hi. Good morning, Tamara and Zora. There was a that was a beautiful clearing. I really enjoyed that. Well, thank you. Thank you. Do you have a question, sweetie? 
Yes, I was wondering, um, every time I go to the gym, I get really weak feeling. I, I'm not sure if it has to do with some kind of um, past life thing or if it has to do with my body. I, I love going to the gym and I, and I do it from choice, um, but a lot of times I get there and start getting on a machine and my, my whole body goes weak, especially my upper body. Sorry, do you have a question, an answer to that? I don't know, um, but maybe... Speak up a little bit in your microphone, honey. I'm not um, clairvoyant like Tamara, but uh, maybe it's just the machines. Maybe it would be better to go out into nature and let the earth support you and um, just... Um, you can do stretches and, and, and muscle stuff also lying on the grass or something uh, instead of being on a machine. That's, that's what my feeling is. Yeah, with all that electricity and stuff affecting her body, right? Yeah. That's interesting. I like yeah. that. Yeah, that sounds really cool. Unfortunately, I'm locked into a gym membership for oh. uh, another year and a half. <laughs> Maybe you can sell it to someone who wants it. I, I have seen people doing that, um, just selling your membership to someone. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. I, I actually really enjoy going to the gym. It's kind of my social network place okay. where I get to connect with people because I, I work out of my house. So it's one of the few times that I actually get to be social. Well, go to the gym and go use the mats and stuff and maybe not the electrical machines. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah, I could just go and uh, do the hand weights and things like that. There you go. Awesome. Thank you, honey. Thank you. Okay, Kat. Bringing you on. Hi, sweetie. It's, oops, sorry. Go ahead and unmute yourself. <laughs> Hi. Okay. Let's see. Hi. <laughs> can you hear me all right? Yes, can hear you just fine. Okay, good. Well, I don't know. I just um, been having to go to doctors a lot. I found out I have four uterine tumors and one breast tumor so recently. And <laughs> I'm uh, trying to do natural healing. I really felt that. I brought tears to my eyes that singing. Good, good. Um, okay. Um, Zara, you want to do some hands-on healing with her? You're muted, sweetie. Yeah. Uh, I think it's better if you do that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You want to join me in it? Do you mind, Kat, do you mind if we both do it? Oh, sure. I would love that. Okay, so you've got a tumor in your breast and three in your, or four in your um, uterus? uterus? Yes. Okay, so let's go in and zap them and um, see them explode and into love and light and re totally replace with light. And with it being in the uterus and being in your breast, that's trying to bring family together, um, trying to get a closeness, feeling um, separated, and then there's a lot of pain in your uterus of, um, of lack and love and stuff like that. Does that make sense to you? Yeah, and I have bleeding. I've had bleeding issues my whole life. <laughs> yeah. Mean, yeah. Yeah. Okay. So focus on all of that while we're doing this, okay? Okay.
Okay. Um, now, as far as nutrition goes, tons of spirulina. <laughs> oh, I just bought some more. So yeah, I have I just bought some. Good baking that. soda, and molasses. Yeah, I haven't been doing that as much. <laughs> you know, I, I was doing and tons and tons of vitamin C. Okay, I do have some powder. Yeah, then you know you you're gonna want to do at least ten grams a day. Oh, okay. I haven't been doing that. <laughs> Split it up a little bit because it might give you the massive runs. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. And then let us know how you're doing, Kat. All right. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Okay. Um, Cindy Amber. We know who she is. <laughs> uh. Hi, Cindy. Hi. Oh, shoot. What? We can hear you. Okay, that's good. I was trying to start my video. I just wanted to tell Zara that was amazing. Wasn't it? I mean, your voice was so beautiful and so ancient. It just like gave me the chills. And then I felt all this kind of burdens lifting from my heart. And um, oh, now... Wow. Yeah, no, it was, it was, it was big. And now I feel this like intense sadness in my heart. So I'm wondering like what that's all about, but it was powerful. Yeah, but that's, that's coming up to be released. Yeah, right? I figured. Let's just, just feel it, just feel yeah. it and let it flow through you and then it can release. Right. Anyway, thank you. That was, I was blown away. That was beautiful. Oh, thank you. And drink, drink lots of water. Oh, I've got will, Yeah, will help. Thank you. Thank you. I love hearing that. <laughs> okay, I'm going to read off. Thank you, Cindy. Love you, sweetie. Love you. Okay, Kim says, thank you, Zara. Awesome. Lisa says, love this. I was pulled from my wants into my spine. Sandra says, thank you. Cuckoo says, beautiful. Um, Romana says, awesome. Carrie loves going inside is free. Yes, it is. Of course it is. Life grid on its way. On way in. Okay. Anu, I'm going to um, unmute you, sweetie. Or you want to unmute yourself? Yes. Hi. Hi, bro. How Thank are you, you sweetie? Zara. I'm good. So I just went on the site yesterday and bought a handful of activations. I'm beginning to listen them. Oh, good. <laughs> so with the things that we've been working on, I would like you to have a look at my kidneys and adrenals. Is there something going on? That's the area that hurts a lot when I have to stand for a bit also. Okay, so your kidneys, you have some pain going on in your kidneys? Not in the kidneys, in my back, in that area where the kidneys and adrenals are usually. Okay. That starts hurting very easily if I sit like without back rest for a long while or I stand for a while. You worked on my back last week. Yeah. Yeah. And okay. Plus there is a lot of uh, anger and irritation comes up even when I'm like, uh, you know, resolving the issues that we worked on with my family. And I'm doing my best not to bring that anger and irritation everywhere. Yeah, don't bring it into them, but good that it's coming up because it's releasing and it'll continue to release. What we're doing, honey, doesn't automatically go like this. I know. Sometimes but like, it does. But sometimes it takes days, even weeks, and it just mm -hmm. keeps erasing and erasing and erasing. And the anger and reason comes up to be released. It's just like, you know, with the things going on, like it won't be healthy for this to show up. <laughs> We'll go into the bathroom, count to three. Because <laughs> I understand. I mean, there's been times after I do a webinar, two or three days later, I get really, really frustrated. Oh, gosh. And it's like, why am I so frustrated? It's like, Tamara, you did a webinar three days ago and your stuff's shifting. And it's like, oh, yeah. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. So it's, it's so normal and it's okay. But the intensity of anger and stuff I could get into six years ago versus now is like 99% better. Yes. 
I can I still get mad, mad, but I can't feel the anger and it doesn't, it only lasts a couple seconds if I get mad. Yes. Yeah. A few minutes it lasts for me, I won't lie. <laughs> yeah. So that's good. Uh -huh. Congratulations. Thank you. You're welcome. Um, Zara, you want to do a hands-on healing with uh, Anu on her back? I can try. <laughs> Uh, um, I'm not very um, practiced in it. That's so okay. Can... You've done the medical intuitive. You know God's the healer. So just connect and do what you see to do. Okay. Thank Is you. that all right with you, Anu? Yes, perfect. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Oh, man. <laughs> I'm being asked to, to make sounds again for it. Good. Go for it. Go ahead. If, yeah. If that's okay. Yes. Yeah. Okay, I'm, I'm going to sing into the place on, on your body. Thank you. Hey, <laughs> I am my, I am my, yeah, yeah. I'm my, I am my, yeah, yeah. And I'm, um, I'm hearing that you can do it when you're feeling angry. Uh, let it out through your voice, not not at the people, but like um, just uh, make some sounds. So, ah! Like okay, this, you know. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> just just a sort of um, bringing it out of your body. Because uh -huh. it's, it, it stores there, you know, you, you, if you, if you um, bring it down, if you suppress it, then it will um, get stuck there. Okay. So, so you can bring it out through your voice and also through movement. Oh, cool. <laughs> Thank you, honey. All right, Anu, have a beautiful week, okay, sweetie? Thank you. Thank you. Okay, Lisa. Can you unmute yourself, honey? There I am. Hi. Hi. So that was amazing, Zara, because I was doing that. This is what I want. And they said, yeah, we're dealing with this now. And the energy went into my lower spine, and it's still vibrating up my back. And I've had a lot of problems down there, but it is amazing. My back feels so strong right now. I haven't felt this way since I can remember. So wow. Thank you. Awesome. I just had thank to tell you. you, I can just feel it still coming up. And when you did the bit on Anu, it just reinforced it all as well. Yeah, that, that sometimes it happens that it's also good for other participants. Yeah, so thank you very much. I'm loving it. Yeah, oh, you're welcome. <laughs> thank you, Lisa. Thank you. Okay, Ramana, can you unmute yourself, sweetie? Am I unmuted? You are unmuted. Hi, honey. Good morning. Good morning. So, Tamara, I had the best performance of my life last night. Thank you. Woohoo! Good job. Um, I don't know for those of any, you know, those of you who are listening that don't know, I had a private session with Tamara. Um, and and wonderful vocal vocalization, Zara. You so have past life in Lemuria. Um, but I just, you know, I'm a vocalist as well, and I, I feel like that is my gift for healing. And um, Tamara and I cleared a whole bunch of stuff around authority, stepping into my power. Um, oh, God, what else did we clear? Do you remember? No, <laughs> <laughs> but it, um, I had, I, I was just more in my joy last night and, Good. and usually when I see videos of myself after I performed, I cringe last night and it's on Facebook. There was just the best video of our, of our performance. So I'm, I'm actually liking myself on stage, which yeah. is, which is big for me to because I'm very critical. Um, and I just, you know, but I want to say, and I was glad that you brought something up, 
that I did, because I did such a big shift with you on Saturday, or whenever it was, um, I did have a major betrayal issue happen between a former minister of a, of a church I used to go to and the current minister of the new church I'm going to, unity-based. Um, is that just saying, hi, we need to be cleared? Yeah, absolutely. Or it could be something that was going on and and it shows up in a big way. And then just to show you that it's shifting. And I bet you handled it differently than you would have before, right? Because this time you stood in your power. I, I Yes, um, I did. Um, and I just, you know, I, I guess I, yeah, so, so I'm thinking all of the activations we did, it just, you know, there's a wound that I obviously have to address. And I like what Zara said about releasing. I allowed myself to feel the feelings of this. If there's anything else you guys would like to share about it, it was just, it was just a giant betrayal of being very committed to a church and then them saying some unflattering things about me behind my back. And I, I don't know if it's an activation of what people say is none of my business. I don't know. I don't know what to make of it, but it, but it, it brought up deep betrayal, which I'm not surprised. Right. Yeah. So I, I think it's shifted. I think you're good. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. That's awesome. Congratulations, honey. Thank you. Love you. You're welcome. So if you guys don't know, I do do private sessions. <laughs> and we have fixed it because there were some mistakes. Um, so you can book one session or you can book three and save 36%. Um, Jenny, I think you are next. Hi, Jenny. Hi, can you hear me? Yes. Beautiful, thank you. Um, I have been going through, I think, my one of my issues that I'm realizing in life, even as an adult, as you get older and then I have children, that my support structures that I put, and when you guys were talking about the spine, there's a lot of stuff dealing with the earth. I felt it so strong when you sang that I don't have the needed, I don't think, support structures in my life. Okay. Zara? Just, I'm just sending you a big hug. <laughs> yeah. Because I, you know, if anybody saw me from the outside, they would say, you're so strong. You do everything by yourself. And what I'm realizing is that, you know, when you have children, you need to build support structures. You need to have you yeah. know, other opportunities and um, help in, in order for them to, you know, and so I'm realizing I don't and I haven't built this and I think there's a lot of stuff about, you know, um, just not believing and trusting that other people have the same belief structures that I do and that you, their advice or their help is not really even appreciated a lot of the times because it just feels like it holds you back. And so I feel more and more isolated. And, but then you realize that you can't, like you can't go through life being so isolated. Uh -huh. so, so like, as I grow and I feel like I'm evolving, sometimes I just want to contract, but then you mm -hmm. have children and you can't. <laughs> so they keep, they bring all these issues up where you need multiple support structures through everything. And I just don't know how to get, you know, make all those things work so that you just feel at peace and love all the time instead of at conflict and kind of like resentment because you don't have, there's not enough people that <laughs> like can support the way you want to go forward instead of just being stuck in all these bad, or these processes that just don't work anymore. Right. Okay, you so um, family constellations, inner child, 
Um, anger and resentment towards God. Um, um, just your heart is so close because you've been hurt so much. You're just so afraid of letting anybody in, even friends. Okay. That's what I'm hearing. Zara, you want to help me run activations? And do you have some other ones you can hear? Um, not hearing activations, but what I wanted to ask. Okay, was, um, go ahead. Um, I wanted to ask was, uh, did you set an intention when I sang to build a support structure for yourself? Um, it wasn't so much a support structure as what I just kept hearing. The intention was a lot of body things like um, mm. letting go, just being, um, there's so many thoughts that I have about what I want to create or just that idea of creating and every, all the women that have talked about, even the woman that was talking about the issues with her breast and her womb about, you know, I felt such deep connection with the earth when you, when you did it and about these, I would see these triangles and like these big pyramids almost and this energy around the pyramids at the base and going up and just about this understanding of like this, as women, we have these triangles in our bodies, almost of this deep creation. And it's not just that we're creating these life, but we are life and like stepping into life. That's what I kept feeling. So my, my okay. you know, and then what I was feeling is sometimes I feel very separate from my body. I feel like there's two consciousness living at the same time. There's this this spiritual consciousness and then there is this body consciousness and the body consciousness is very supported by the earth you know like this uh and it's almost like there's two programmings running in me inside of me and that sometimes the earth energy there's it's so different than the spiritual energy of 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 and I don't know it's they they get they get their yes. support through different ways and yeah but, like, but I can't, you, I can't you figure that out you need the earth energy to support your body, right? Yeah. To be to be, uh, to be in a in a good relationship with the life on earth and feel supported, you you really need the earth. So it might feel different than the spiritual energy, but you need both of them. You can't uh, if if you're only up there, then you will never have the space that you that um. Um, that ground structure that supports you to stand on, right? Yeah. Yeah. So, but it's it's like the it's like the earth, and there's like a really deep part of that, like of the earth, like even on the inside, all the way, like that energy of who she is. But then it's all this creation and life that you have on the surface of the earth. Like I feel like sometimes your bodies want to connect with all of that, right? And that's like a support structure, but somehow that's in conflict with like the, some other energy running in me too. And I don't understand that. I think there are, um, it might be a past life thing from um, when you were into teachings uh, that said to go away from the earth and only into the higher energies because there has been lots of that in the past teachings okay. that, that tell you to go um, beyond the earth. So maybe that's where the conflict comes from. Okay. Yeah. And um, total body connection is really yeah. good for that too. Yeah. Help you bring you into your body. Um, same thing and with mother earth is mother also earth. Good. Yeah. yeah. Mother Earth would be really good. Yeah. yeah, total body connection also because I used to be separate from my body. I was not in my body until I did total body connection. And it was quite shocking to be in a body. <laughs> it's like, wow. So, um, and I did that last week. If you go to the replays, um, since you're on my mailing list, since you're on Zoom, um, do last week's video that has a lot of that will help you with this. Okay. Okay. Um, cause we've, I just did all of that. So I'd go back and listen to those replays and they'll really help you with that. Great. Thank you. You're welcome. And, um, what is it? Can I talk? 
Okay. Um, so, um, Jenny, I'm just going to um, run those activations. I already said inner child, family constellations, and I'll do total body connection. So um, we'll go ahead and do that again. And then um, people are asking if you'll do light language at the end of the call. Zara? Yeah, I can. Sure. Okay, good. So let's run these activations, and then we're going to let um, Zara close this out with um, some light language. I'm also going to run Mother Earth. Okay, Zara, can you give your website in case people want to get a hold of you to work with you further? Yeah, I can put it on the chat. Now, go ahead and speak it out because there's people also listening on Facebook. It's in German, <laughs> so oh, I don't okay. know. <laughs> so my, I think it might be better if I write it, and I can write it on the Facebook also. Okay, all right. Afterwards. All right. And then um, people are asking for private links for me for private sessions. Um, you'd go to my website, my name, TamaraOviet.com, and um, you can sign up for a private session there, or you can also link over from my main website, SacredActivations.com. Also, um, practitioner training this weekend, if you're interested. Um, that's also, you can get there from Sacred Activations or SAHealingInternational.com. And Zara has um, posted her website. Where is it? I don't see it here. Okay. I don't see it here, but it'll be on my Facebook, and we'll um, mail it out again with the replays. It'll also be on Face um, YouTube. Carrie Love will be there this weekend in class. Yay! Awesome. Yeah. Um, I still don't see it. Okay, so go ahead and do some light language and then we'll close out. Okay, so um, thank you everybody. Kaiki, Ananaiki, Ganamani, Azatta Kinia, Azatta Kina, Nantaiki, Gomanaya, Anakataya Zatta, Gantanamana Eki, Azani, and Taya. Ganeya, Gantanaki, Thai, Azataki, Ganamanaki, Hantanana Eki, Azani, Atai, Gomaneya, Hanganaki, Ni, Anantaki, Gantanaki, Azataki, Atana, Anantai, Goyani, Asti. Okay. Thank you. Do you have any idea what you were saying or what it meant? I, th I think it was about um, um, go. And uh, and seize your power and create, and um, don't be afraid um, of of things that are like um, in your uh, in your world, because you are the creators of everything. That's right. So it's awesome. Thank you, honey. Thank you so much for joining me. This was such a blessing to have you on um, the call today to share you with the world. I think you're absolutely amazing and um, really appreciate you. Um, 
Zara is also a teacher of sacred activations. So if you're interested in learning from her, she also teaches. She also does sacred activations and light language and all that other beauty. She has all kinds of things she does. She's absolutely a beautiful being. I think she's absolutely amazing. And as you see her face, man, you can hardly even see her face because it's just covered with light. <laughs> it's the sun. <laughs> I know, but it's just so beautiful. <laughs> All right, you guys, thank you very much. This is the end um, of today. Uh, the, definitely go through and listen to the replays. It'll be on my page here. It'll be on YouTube, and we'll be mailing it out next week. Um, but it's, it's always nice to go read through these things because it helps you switch. Okay, so um, see you on the weekend. Good, Lisa's coming to class too. Yay! All right, you guys, love you. Have a great weekend. Bye. What?